version of See It Now titled Christmas in Korea was filmed in a war zone halfway around the world just a few days before it was broadcast. Something unheard of in the days before jetliners and satellites and videotape. Speaking to you, not from the control room of Studio 41, but from the Korean front, is Edward R. Murrow. This is Korea. This is the front. Just there, no man's land begins. And on the ridges over there, the enemy positions can be clearly seen. In the course of the next hour, we shall try to show you around Korea a bit. SI-297! SI-297! Elevation, four, one, three. Elevation, four, one, three. Stand by. Fire. What, uh, what would you fellows like to be doing if you were home now? Are you kidding? <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll be frank. I'd like to be sitting in the car with my girlfriend right now. <laughs> well, um, who's the man first? to be released from here. Who's got his points coming up first? There he is. Corporal Black. Black. How, long, how long do you have to go, Corporal? Well, I've got two months to go. I stay at 12 months. Are you counted by months or days? Uh, <laughs> by long time to do it. Let me get home soon enough. <laughs> Surgical Hospital. We're going in to talk some of the nurses. They are American girls closest to the fighting any woman in Korea. And on the radio last night that the communists are threatening to capture Seoul by Christmas? Boy, well, there's been a lot of artillery the last few days. But I don't think we have anything to worry about. We got a good division up there. The casualties we got in last night, today. What happened? I don't know. There was an awful lot of artillery last night and a bunch sure of us. me up. 
bunch of Australians coming in, mm? out on patrol, and they got clobbered this morning. This is Combat Ops of the 4th Fighter Interceptor Group, F-86 Sabre Jets. Everyone on the base watches this sign. Early in the morning, the sign goes up, have no megs yet. And then when the day's operations are completed, the sign is put up showing the kill for the day. Everyone on the base watches this sign. It's the way the enlisted men and everyone else can tell how the group was done in the day's fighting against the megs. This count would be about average, though, for the normal day. Two destroyed, one probable, and one damaged. These are Sabre Jet pilots, F-86 boys, who go up where no cameraman and no reporter can go with them.